obituaries are sponsored by Colonial Funeral Home and Stokes Chapel, Fair, Ray, and Perry Spencer Funeral Homes, Boone and Cook Funeral Home and Crematory. The family of James Wayne Payne, 68 of Madison, will receive friends today at 1 at Beulah Baptist Church, with funeral services at 2 and interment in Collins Cemetery. This announcement from Perry Spencer Funeral Home in Madison. Five announcements from Fair Funeral Home. Arrangements for Violet Annette Barrier are incomplete. William Bill Andrew Habeski, Jr., 83 of Eden, died April 24th. Graveside services are tomorrow at 2 at Danview Cemetery, with visitation at 1. He was born in Bristol, Connecticut, was a graduate of Bristol High School, class of 1959, a member of Meadowview United Methodist Church and former member of Riverview Presbyterian Church. He worked as a boiler room attendant at Karistan Rug Mill until retirement. Surviving are brother David Habeski, sisters Judy Morozik, Jane Goodwin, Karen Conrad, all of Bristol, and Ellen Jones of Arizona. He was preceded in death by wife Annette Thompson Habeski. In lieu of flowers, memorial contributions may be made to Hospice of Rockingham County. Albert Frank Frankie Norman, Jr., 61, of Eden, died April 24th. Memorial services are Friday at 2, with visitation at 1. He worked as a customer service representative for Martinsville Division of Motor Vehicles. Surviving are mother, Hazel N. Jones, stepfather, Bill Jones, sister, Rhonda Stone and Lanny, all of Eden, and wife, Melissa Norman and dog, Bailey. Memorial services for Raymond Marty Martin Rutledge, 42 of Eden, are Saturday at 2, with visitation at 1. David G. Wood, 80, of Eden, died April 21st. There will be no formal services per his request. He was born in Mason City, Iowa, and served in the United States Navy as a barber. He owned a trucking company. Survivors include friends Tyke and Mike Robertson of Eden. Special thanks to UNC Rockingham Rehabilitation and Nursing for their care. Memorial services for Kelly Maureen Reed, 46 of Eden, are Saturday at 2 at Charity Baptist Church. Boone and Cook Funeral Home is serving the family.